All right, welcome back. Welcome back to the Happy Place Diaries. In this episode, we're going to pull back the curtain and accept the challenge, the 40 question challenge. Stick around, you're gonna really wanna know <laughs> what our answer to number 40 is. All right. So okay, first of all, I wanna thank Steve from Avenging RV Adventures uh, for challenging Teresa and I to the uh, 40 question challenge. And we ha we've watched a couple of the videos, but to be honest with you, wasn't really looking at what the questions are. So we printed them. I've got and them. Neither one of us have really uh, looked at the uh, questions, so we're just going to answer them sight unseen. I'm ready. Are you ready? Yeah, let's go. Okay, number one. Do you like blue cheese? No. I do, yes. Okay. <laughs> All right, next one. I don't know how we're going to do on these. Uh, Coke or Pepsi? Uh, I used to be a Coke guy, um, but ever since my surgery, I have had a pop. So well, you've had a couple, but it's I've had a couple, but usually it's mixed it's with uh, Jack Daniels. <laughs> so. uh, mine is definitely Pepsi. I am a Pepsi girl. Okay, Come here, buddy. Um, number Sorry. three, it says in a relationship. Mm, yeah. Yeah, yeah, for about you know, thirty, thirty some odd years. Okay, number four. Whiskey, tequila, or vodka? Uh, whiskey for me. Whiskey. Totally whiskey. Uh, yeah, I had my but tequila you like years. Bourbon, but you like bourbon better. Well, yeah, but that's a off, that's a, that's okay. the offspring of... Okay. Um, this one's hard. Hot dog or cheeseburger? Uh, hot dog. Hot dog? For me, hot dog, definitely. Mine would be a cheeseburger, but it had to, would have to have bacon on it. Um... Favorite food? Mine's a good bacon cheeseburger. I have to admit. My favorite food is is uh, German food, and in particular, um, a dish called Rolladen. Um, anything that I don't have to cook is my <laughs> what number seven. What do you drink in the a.m. Water. Um, I drink a protein shake and a cup of coffee okay in the a.m. in the a.m. can you do a hundred push-ups eventually <laughs> yeah not in a row <laughs> yes, I used to be able to but uh, yeah. if I had to do it right now and like within so many minutes no yeah okay uh, favorite season fall um, also known as autumn I like spring and summer because the the it's lighter out later. I was just commenting on how I don't like it getting so dark so early in the in the winter time. So I just I, I love fall because I love of all the, the, seasons. the the crisp mornings. Um, I like the the colors of fall. Oh, I do. But yeah, I like all the seasons. But that would be my. That would be my favorite, I guess. All right, go. Uh, number 10, favorite hobby. I do card making and scrapbooking with my girlfriends. So that's one of my favorite hobbies. And walking and hiking and I camping. I don't know what my favorite hobby I guess the, the, the RV has become a hobby. I love shooting. Um... Shooting as in pew, 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 pew. Yeah, pew, pew, shooting. <laughs> okay, any other hobbies? I, I, I don't know. I guess, you know, no, not really. Okay. Number 11. We got a bunch of hobbies, I guess. Number 11. Any tattoos? Yes. yes. I have one. I have two. But I want another one. Me too. So, uh, do you wear glasses? I don't know. <laughs> yes. Uh, phobias. Snakes. Yeah, snakes is mine. And contrary to, um, I'm not a big fan of heights, even though I jumped out of airplanes for a living. But, you know, like getting on the roof is not my favorite thing. Oh. And, I, and I was a certified climbing instructor 
but there, I, so I have a respect for heights, and I also have a respect for um, the gear, you know, like a, a parachute or the ropes and stuff. Okay, that bird again. Well, I mean, it's still a phobia, but I know how to control that. But snakes, no snakes. What's your phobias? Um, I'm afraid of uh, drowning. I don't think I have any other phobias. Drowning. Yeah. I hear once you get to the point where you're about to die, it's very calming. Well, yeah, but I, it just freaks me out. <laughs> I don't want to try it. Yeah, I don't either. No. Uh, nicknames. Um, I go by T or Mrs. S. You go by F. <laughs> we'll edit that out. <laughs> He's the big I A. I don't think I have a nickname. He's the big A when, um, Jer. I okay. mean, it's not Jerry, but Jer. Uh, but Papa. First, but yeah. nobody calls you Papa yet, so. Um, favorite candy? Chocolate. Um, it just depends. I love Three Musketeers. I love Kit Kats. And Gummy Bears. And Gummy Bears. And Charleston Chew, so... There's just a, a but I always but I always default to, to chocolate. Yeah. Yeah. Chocolate is definitely a weakness. Um, number sixteen. Oh yeah. Do you believe in ghosts? Yes, I do. No. I watch all the shows, and I just yes, I do. No. I I I don't. Um, I've been I've been to like Gettysburg, and I've been to those places that they say are haunted. Um, what about and the nobody pin ever sees anything. What about the pinwheel? That's not a ghost. That was a spirit. A ghost is a spirit. No, it's th yes. they're different. No, they're not. They're the same. No. Yes. Okay. Biggest downfall. What's my biggest downfall? <laughs> we don't have all day. <laughs> my biggest downfall is that um, I... I lack patience sometimes, especially um, when it comes to um, people not doing things right. Because my I guess because I'm always right. I don't know. I think that's my, my we'll biggest that. my biggest downfall is I don't you don't I care. don't trust people. Yeah, you just well. And no, I care. Well, you care. That's why. And so I, I have a lack of trust in people until they prove that they can be trusted. My biggest downfall is I, be, I think I believe everything everybody says. That's, that's true. I think that, that's... that and your biggest downfall, in my opinion, is you let emotion drive rather than... Knowledge. Yeah, logic and whatnot. All right. Um, the next... The, 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 number 18. Rain or snow. If it's raining and it's hard and we're in the trailer, I love it. And I love the snow. Just period. I love it when we get snow here because we don't get it very often. So I like, if I had to choose one or the other, if it's dry snow, I like it. I, I was an avid skier for a long time. I love snow up on the mountain. I like the ability to go to snow. Yes. I don't like it when it snows here. I do. Um, so I guess I would take rain because I could totally function in the rain, no problem. Okay. Uh, piercings, four. Two on each ear. None. And it ain't going to happen. <laughs> uh, your age. I'm 54. Almost 55. Almost 55. And I am 51. French fries or onion rings? Now, if I have to pick, I would pick French fries. Onion rings. Kids? Lots. Well, no, we don't have any kids. We have adults now. <laughs> three. We have three that John, are in their mid-20s. All of them are in their mid-20s. John and Caitlin are 20. Almost, tw almost 27. And Josh is almost 25. Yeah, and next month is all three of their birthdays, so... Okay, favorite color? Green. 
I'm the wishy-washy one. I don't have like a favorite e color. Even though I probably have more blue, like blue clothes, blue everything, but green is my favorite color. I'd have to say pink. Okay, can you sing? No. I can. I can sing, but I can't sing well. <laughs> can you whistle? Yes. No. I cannot whistle. I wish I could. Uh, where were you born? I was born in Munich, Germany. And I was born in Middletown, Ohio. Siblings. Yes. I have a sister and a brother. And I have two sisters and two brothers. Can you cook? Well, I can, but I don't like to. I can. And he's really good. And I'm good at it. Can you swim? Absolutely. Yes. Are you religious? I don't know that I would consider myself religious, but I have very strong faith. And I, and I think you could separate the two. I, th I When I think of religion, I think of the institution. Yeah. Of going to church and all of that. And we were very devout in all of that for a long time. Uh, but since, I mean, I think I've I have a strong sense of spirituality and faith, but religious, probably not so much. Shower or bath? Shower. Shower. We really don't have a good bath to take a bath, so shower. We got a bath, but I just don't like sitting in my dirty... I mean... Okay, yeah. Big city or out in nature? Nature. Uh, nature. Totally. Yeah, you can have all the big cities. Um, are you a good friend? I'm a great friend. I think I'm a great friend. I think I'm a good friend, too. I, I, I think I'm the kind of friend... I'm the I'm the 3 o'clock in the morning friend. Mm -hmm. That if you called at 3 o'clock in the morning, I'm there. Right. Um, I'd do anything for you. I But with friendship comes... I See, I think friendship has to be absolute mutual. So if you don't... Like, if you don't want my opinion, then don't ask for it. Because I'm the kind of friend that will... Tell be you. honest with you and if it's not if it's you know so yeah I'm a good friend but I'm 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 the kind of friend that what you see is what you get so and luckily all the people that we hang out with they know that they know that and, and we're all pretty much like that so. okay uh, number 34 let me go first <laughs> <laughs> broke any bones I broke my big left toe that's it Yes. Uh, your nose. Your nose a couple of times. Color bo both of my clavicles. Your arm. Knee, your leg. Your knee. Your finger. Fingers. Um, shoulder. Yeah, I've I've had a bunch of, of bro ribs. Yeah, I just got one, and that was like f six years ago. Okay, how many TVs? How many TVs do we own? We own one two, three, but only two of them are plugged in because the one in our bedroom is not plugged in. The one in the living room, the one in the trailer. Yeah, that's it. And the one in the, uh, yeah, yeah, so two, three. Three. Yeah, and the one, yeah, the one in the room, I don't even know why we have that. Well, I was going to, I want to put it in our bedroom in here. Okay, we can see about doing that. Okay, number 36. 36? 36. Worst pain ever. It hurt too much to talk about. <laughs> I think when I had the cyst on my ovary that ruptured. That hurt me too. That was that was the worst pain. Even with giving birth to Josh, that was way worse. Um, do you like to dance? Yeah, I do. <laughs> I do too. When there's good music on. And it's... And, and, again, it's kind of like um, the singing. I like to do it, but I'm not good at it. <laughs> um, I'm gonna, can I put this one last? Sure. Well, you could do whatever you want. Okay, so we're going to put... This is America. This is number 38. I'm actually going to put as number 40. So, um, the next one is, are you weird? Pretty much. I, I, I can be. I'm, I, I don't know that I'm weird. I'm weird to some people. Yeah. But um, but I don't care. 
Uh, number 39. So, so take that. Favorite ice cream. Vanilla bean. Rocky Road. <laughs> Rocky Road? <laughs> And the best rocky road that Jerry ever found was down at the Lake of the Ozarks. Yeah, so we were at the Lake of the Ozarks. We stopped at this little teeny... Okay, this is back in 1993. Yeah, but we stopped at there. And this ice cream shop was about the size of our trailer. And we had rocky road there that was absolutely the best. And I actually went back in... To see if they would sell me the entire <laughs> tub. Tub. What was that a ten gallon, five gallon? Yeah, tub? whatever. The, the big, you know, like when you go to Baskin Robbins, the ones that they scoop. And this wasn't the Baskin Robbins. This was homemade ice cream. Yep. And they wouldn't sell it to me. Well, that and we had a three hour drive back to Kansas. Yeah, City. but I probably wouldn't. <laughs> well, between Craig and I, we. But it was the best. Now, my brother-in-law, Craig, went back to that place yeah. years later and said that it was either gone or they didn't do yeah, it. Yeah, it was gone. I think it was yeah. gone. Yeah. All right. Number 40. We changed it around, so our number 40 is different than what your number 40 will be. Do you like camping? Yeah, it's pretty much what we do. I love it. If This weekend, if we could have been camping, we probably would have. So, and... and to be more specific, I like RVing because I, I've camped my entire life um, and I've camped hundreds of nights with the scouts and did all of that. I was an avid backpacker, did sections of the Pacific Crest Trail in, and all of that. Um, but in our maturing age, this right here is our glamping yeah and some people would argue that this isn't camping anymore so be it um really enjoy it in fact um we're camping like the entire month of november yeah we are i mean Almost well just weekend. about every weekend yeah. of november yeah um we're gonna be out and it it's it's not because we don't like being no it is it's because we just don't like being in town yeah. We like going out, getting disconnected, you know, being kind of out and enjoying ourselves, our friends. Especially during this time with the COVID going on and the elections coming up. It's kind of stressful, at least for me, and I just want to get away from everybody and everything. So, yeah, especially because of where we live, you know, being in the Portland metro area. Um, the more time we can spend away from here, the better, I, I think. So, okay, so that, that is it. That is it. Are we supposed to challenge somebody? Yeah, we're going to challenge, um, Michael and Shelly from Epic. our Epic RV Adventure. And we're going to challenge our other great, uh, friends, uh, Dustin and Leslie from Wayward. the Wayward Wags. And we're also going to do a bonus challenge of anybody that wants to answer these questions. Um, and and we'll see what uh, what you guys come up with. We think it's kind of fun to kind of pull back the curtain a little bit. And, you know, especially now because people are searching for content. Well, here you go. Here's some content for you. And um, this is us. This really is us. And, and people that know us know that uh, the people that you're watching are the people that if we met in a campground, this is this is who we are. This is what you get. And you know we're we're you know we like to consider ourselves fun and and somewhat adventurous and and just you know going back to the um, you know the friends thing. You know I'm the kind of person that just talks to strangers, so uh, you get what you get and. We hope that these 40 questions um, shed some light a little bit more on on a little bit about who we are. And um, with that, if you like the video, give us that thumbs up. If you... Oh, there's a fly. How'd a fly get in here? Um, 
where was I? Like and share and comment and share with a friend. Uh, and if you're new to our channel, go ahead and hit that little subscribe button and the little bell, and that'll let you know when our next video is coming out, which will be on Sunday. So, um, with that, we'll see you next time. Yeah, thanks for watching. We had fun. All right. Okay. Let's go. Oh.